The numbers show the challenge ahead. 70% of the world's population face water scarcity at least one month a year, while 500 million people, about 6% of the population, face clean water access issues all year long. Water is at the core of sustainable development and is critical for socioeconomic growth, energy and food production, healthy ecosystems, and for human survival itself. Water is also at the heart of adaptation to climate change, serving as the crucial link between society and the environment. We think of water as something that is just here. We expect to open the taps and out flows clean drinking water. But for millions of people throughout the world, that is just not the case. As temperatures rise, water and sanitation systems are challenged to prevent infrastructure damage, which leads to a loss of services and compromised water quality. Like many auto manufacturing companies, Toyota has traditionally relied heavily on water as part of its assembly process. We want to return the water in a better condition than what we received it. And a lot of times that's true. You know, our receiving waters are dirtier than we can use in our process. So we have to clean it before we can use it, and then we have to clean it before we can let it go back into its natural course. So to us, that's very important. You know, we give it back better than it was. We look to pilot technologies to increase efficiencies and reduce our water withdrawal, then take those lessons learned and apply them to all the other assembly plants in North America. And this assembly plant in Baja, California, is no exception. This is where Toyota uses a highly efficient water recycling process. From that wastewater process, we also are recycling, so that water is sent back to the process. So there is a part that the waste and the raw water process combine, and that way we avoid take water from the lake because we are recirculating the water that we use in the process. The automaker's water conservation efforts are happening nationwide. Here at Toyota Indiana, we're engaged into protecting and also improving the environment for not only our kids, but our kids' as kids. By 2050, the company aims to make its manufacturing plants carbon neutral and eliminate CO2 emissions from all operations. This is Nika Zhang in Thousand Oaks, California.